do you guys want to see a result like this? 4K in a single day, almost 6K in a single day. Here, another screenshot, 7K in a single day. Another one, 2K in a single day. Another one, 17K in a single day. Those are all screenshots of our own shop, of our own shop that we're currently running or we have been uh, running in the past few months. Guys, you need to understand there's only one thing that you need to do in dropshipping in order to be successful, and it's testing consistently. I see a lot of people focusing on the wrong things. Stop focusing on the wrong things. You need to start testing consistently in order to have winning products. So guys, you need to understand something. A lot of people, the only thing they want to do is upsell you, is make more money out of you. So they are going to tell you, oh, maybe your website is not good. So they can charge you for a better website and you will pay them a few hundred dollars uh, to have a better website. And the, rep the website is not even the problem. The problem is just that you don't have a good product. Again, uh, some of them will tell you, oh, you don't have any application uh, for upsells. I see it, it It destroys my mind how some people are, are paying like $100, $200 on apps and they don't have a successful store. They don't have a store that make consistent sales. You need to understand something. The goal here in dropshipping is to find a winning product. When you have a winning product in your hand, then you can pay to customize your store and make it more branded, um, more personal, uh, more, let's say, aesthetically pleasing. You can do that. After that, you can add more application for upsells, cross-sales, email marketing, SMS marketing. You can do all of, th all of those when you have a winning product, but only when you have a winning product. If not, then you're just wasting your money and throwing your money out of the window because you're optimizing everything for no reason. If you don't have any sale, what are you optimizing for? Don't optimize. Test consistently products and you will be able to after that, invest into optimization. So don't listen to all of those gurus out there that they tell you, oh, maybe your website is not good enough. Oh, maybe your product description is not good enough. Look, guys, I remember like it was yesterday. Me and my brother, we tested a product. I think it was the Domino Train. And uh, he, I think it was me. I forgot. I forgot to apply. Uh, update the product description. So I forgot to update the product description. And what happened? I had uh, no product description and one photo. So no product description and one single photo because I forgot to click the button save uh, to save everything that I did. And I basically went to bed, woke up the next day and I had like six sales. And I was like, wait, six sales? Oh, that's maybe a winner. And when I went to my Shopify store, I saw that I had no description and one single photo. And this blew my mind entirely. So I was like, okay, wait, I have one Shopify store with a product that I'm testing with no description and a single photo. And it's bringing me sales, six sales. So it's possibly a winning product. And I didn't have an, optim an optimized description, an optimized photos, because I, I, I forgot to save. I forgot to save uh, the page, so everything uh, didn't save. The only thing that was uh, saved from the previous save that I did was only the photo and a blank description, and I was able to make some sales. So I'm like, if without description and possibly the ugliest photo that you can have, I was able to make six sales. Then it just means if you don't have a winning product and you have a quite a decent description, then it's just a product. So stop believing all of those gurus that tell you, oh, add more application. Oh, make a better description. Oh, make better photos. Obviously, if you have better photos, better product, better, uh, better uh, product description, it will help you. But you won't go from 
zero sales to a million uh, sales just because you have a good description. It, it doesn't work like that. It, it needs to have demand in your products. All of those screenshots that I'm showing you right now, 7K in one day, 5K in one day, uh, 17K in one day, all of those screenshots right now are just screenshots from store that people liked the product and they wanted to order it. And what we did is we just optimize everything to make more sales. That's it. Those products did bring us some sales consistently. We just optimize everything to make more. So maybe if I wasn't, let's say, a good experienced dropshipper, I would probably have made, let's say, 2K on this screenshot right here, 2K in sales in a single day, or maybe here 1K or 1.5K, or maybe on this screenshot right here, 4 5K, because I wasn't good enough to optimize uh, my page. I wasn't good enough to add up sales, cross sale bundles. So uh, because I, I maybe wasn't a good drop shipper, I would not have been able to scale uh, those brands to this high level. But let me be clear. If you have a winning product, you will have consistent sales. No matter what your product description, what your uh, reviews or your photos looks like. As long as you have something okay, decent, let's say decent, you will have sales. Obviously, if you want to go from 1K a day to 10K a day, then you need some optimization. Obviously, you need that. But if you don't have an optimized website and you're a beginner dropshipper, you will still get some sales. So stop spending money on things that do not matter. What matter is that you have a clean and simple website, a general store, a general store to be more precise, and that you do product research every single day and you test products as much as you can. I'm not going to say every single day because probably you guys don't have enough budget to test every single day, but find a, an amount of product that you can test on a weekly basis or on a monthly basis, and you're you're going to test them every single week or every single month. If you're like, okay, I can test two products per week. So can, test consistently two products per week without missing a single week. Some people, they test five products in a week, 10 products in a week, 30 products in a week. And after that, they stop testing. And they're like, I'm giving up. Don't give up. Find a paste that you can be comfortable and you can maintain for a long period of time. It's the same thing with the gym. Let's say if you just started a training not long time ago and you go seven days a week, you will get exhausted. You will get exhausted and you will not come back. So if you're like, okay, I won't do seven days a week, but I will do three days a week, maintain that three days a week, and I know we'll be able to maintain it for a long period of time, and I will be able to have results. Same thing with dropshipping. Do what you do in life in the dropshipping world. So, you know, every day you wake up and you go work. Every day, every day you wake up and you go to school. So same thing with dropshipping. Do it in a way that you can maintain it for a long period of time, for six months, a year, two years, and you will have results. I'm not saying that dropshipping is magical. I'm not like the other gurus that, oh yeah, you will have results 100%. What I'm saying is, no matter whatever you do in life, if you're consistent for a long period of time, you will have results, no matter what it is. Some people are luckier or smarter, let's say that way, and they will. it will take a few weeks to have results. Some of them will take a year or maybe more. We don't know. But it doesn't, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter how long it takes you. What matters is that you end up being successful. Same thing for me. Look, me and my brother, we come from a not, like we are not rich. Like our family is not rich. And like literally our family grew up poor. We come from a country called Cuba, and it's a poor country. So when we came in Canada, we didn't have much money. Obviously, uh, our family uh, studied, and um, you know my parents were able to be nurses in Canada, but we weren't 
rich and we weren't related to business. We didn't have anyone in our family that was doing business. Me and my brother, we decided to do drop shipping by our own without people knowing what it was or without having uh, family members that were able to do uh, business. And we did a lot of mistake. We paid a lot of um, you know, people that scammed us. Uh, we did a lot of testing and we we failed multiple times. But now we are successful dropshippers. We do this for a living. We're living in Bali. So what am I what am I saying is doesn't matter your journey. Some people have easier than others, but at the end of the day, what matters is where you end up. And I remember like it was yesterday. I grew up um, in my dropshipping journey with someone, I think his name was um, Logan, I believe, Logan. So this guy, I was, you know, kind of successful in dropshipping, but I wasn't, let's say, really consistent with the income that I was making. And that guy created a single store, a single store, and make made, I believe, 10 million in sales, something like this crazy. And I was like, how that guy? with a single store, was able to make $10 million. And I'm still, uh, in a way, trying to struggle to make consistent income. And he was able to be consistent and make $10 million. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter. At the end of the day, now I'm living in Bali. Now I'm having the best time of my life. And I should not compare myself to other people because there's always people below me and people above me. What I need to focus on is my own journey. So why am I saying all of this? I do not want to deviate from the main thing. And the main thing is, if you want to have results like this, the first thing that you need to do is finding a winning product. When you find a winning product that gives you consistent sales, then you can uh, optimize to make even more sales. But if you have problems uh, bringing sales in your store is only because you don't have a winning product. So guys, um, if you want to start testing, I'm, I'm going to say this on every video because I think it's an insane opportunity. If you want to start testing products consistently and you don't want to spend too much money on under the description below and under this video, uh, you can find our link, our partnering link with TikTok. And what is going to happen is when you click on this link, you will have access to TikTok credit. So the TikTok credit is every time you spend money, they will match the amount in credit on TikTok ads. So if you spend $50, they will give you $50 in TikTok ad credit. If you spend $500, they will give you $500 in TikTok credit up to $1,500. That's a lot of money. I didn't have that when I started drop shipping. So please, guys, if you guys are smart and don't want to spend too much money, click on that link, register, start spending money, and TikTok will match what you spend in ad credits. So you will save a lot of money. It's a win-win. You will be able to test consistently for a long period of time. And now it's Q4. It's the best time to start testing. And uh, you will basically start testing massively without spending too much money. So guys, do it because this thing didn't exist when I started dropshipping. I didn't have that much uh, money and, uh, well, actually I didn't have uh, any ad credit help when I started. I literally started with Facebook and influencers and it was everything out of my pocket. Now there's um, $1 dropshipping um, Shopify store that you can have one dollar Shopify store. I didn't have that, and you need to pay the full price. Uh, so now you can have a Shopify store for one dollar during three months. So you pay one dollar per month during three months. After that, you pay the full price. And if you have a TikTok account that you create uh, with our link, you will have up to fifteen hundred dollars in credit. So it's it's literally amazing. They they're giving you money and they're making you pay a little amounts like one dollars to start drop shipping. There's no better times. I don't know how those deals, how long those deals are going to stay, but I suggest you uh, to take them because um, you'll 
uh, you'll basically spend little, little to no money and you'll be able to really focus on what matters and it's testing products. So guys, if you want to have results like this, start testing products. If you have problems testing products, if you have problems finding the right products, then you can contact us. You can contact me or my brother and we're going to uh, go in a call with you um, for our mentorship program and we're going to help you uh, design a perfect plan for you. Because the thing is, we, do, we don't do uh, a mentoring program where we are in a, let's say, group. We don't do mentoring uh, group. We do a one-on-one -on -one call with you and we design the perfect program with you. Uh, whatever you have, as uh, allocated uh, for drop shipping. So let's say if you have five hundred dollars, a thousand dollars, two thousand dollars for your drop shipping during a journey, then we're going to set up everything in place to make sure that um it, it, you know what to do and you can test consistently. And we're going to design that program specifically for you and your needs. So, guys, this I just made this video to make things clear. And to make sure that you understand that if you have a winning product, it will make consistent sales. If not, keep testing, be consistent, and see you in the next video. Peace out. Take care.